Hello there. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add the files properly for the Blue Sky update onto a USB flash drive. So first off, you need to go to psaudio.com and we need to go get the files. So those files are under support, under downloads. We're going to scroll to latest firmware here and this is the latest one. So you click download here and it will download to your folder that has um, your, your Windows download. So let's go ahead and open that folder. Your browser may look a little different than mine. I'm using Firefox for this one. Okay, there we go. And then what we wanna do is we're gonna go ahead and open this file. Now I'm using a program called WinRAR. It's been around for quite a long time. It's one of the better unzip files. It's a free program, so you can Google WinRAR if you don't see it this way. Uh, Windows also does its own unzipping program. So here, we're gonna open this guy, and this is what the content should look like in that file. All right, now I'm gonna take my USB stick and I'm gonna plug it into my computer. It should pop up for us. There we go. Okay, so now I have a blank USB drive folder. Now, something to note here is do not have any other files in this, this folder here, uh, or the DSD Mark II will not be able to recognize it. Also, this USB drive needs to be in a FAT32 format. There's a really easy way to check that. So in this window that just popped up, you're gonna go down to your USB drive name, you're gonna right click it, go down to properties, and then we can see that our file system is FAT32. If your drive says anything else other than FAT32, you're gonna to have to format this USB device into a FAT32 drive. Um, we'll have a link for the way to do that in, uh, in our forum, and then also you can always ask the team for that too. So, okay. We're gonna go back here. This is our USB drive, again, empty. So now we're gonna take the files that we need to update. So in here, there's two files. It's this one right here, the DSD Mark II uh, underscore V321.bin. We're just gonna drag that over here, okay? And then also the FPGA1 underscore 239 underscore blue sky. We're gonna drag that guy over there. Okay, take just a second. And there we go. So that is all you need to plug the USB into the back of a DSD Mark II to upgrade to Blue Sky. Um, don't need any other files in there, just those. So, okay, thank you so much.